Welcome back to La Mes Farm and this is our Korea Natural Farming Series, the secret to a cost-effective food production and other less livestock farming. This is actually the part 4 video. Make sure to watch part 1, 2, and 3 so you'll know the process from the very beginning. As you can see, our chickens and plants are thriving naturally. And this is a healthy way of farming because we're not using any antibiotics and pesticides or any synthetic chemicals to grow our plants and animals. Make sure to watch until the end because in this video we are making IMO4 or indigenous microorganism stage 4 which make the soil fertile and healthy and it eliminates toxic elements to the soil. For the part 1 to 3 videos, you can check it on the description below. We will post it there. Uh, we will put the links there. And make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell because we will walk you through until the harvest. For the materials needed, it will be the same as what we use in IMO3 process. But we will also write it in our description so you can check it out. The only additional material in IMO4 is the soil, which is equivalent to the amount of IMO3. So ratio is also 1 is to 1. So there you go. This is our IMO3, a successful one. As you can see, there are so many white molds, which are the tiny workers in our farm. Those white molds are the tiny or the microorganisms that will work on our soil to make it fertile so if you have a degraded soil we recommend to uh, for you to do this and add this IMO4 or even 3 it will already work on um, making your soil fertile again so it has to be this moist before we cover it with rice straw the rice straw will serve as a blanket for the um, beneficial microorganisms, th this will warm them up and we will also cover it with tarps to make sure the chickens won't uh, be able to scratch on it and the microorganisms or beneficial microorganisms will be safe. You will be amazed on how nature works because this is effective and we were able to grow vegetables and make our chicken coops odorless. Why do we need to take the process until IMO4? It's because this is how we make the beneficial microorganisms strong enough to fight against any bad bacteria that are taking over our soil. So in five or more days, this will be ready. Um, the right indication is that this will stop heating up. So once uh, it stops heating up, that means the IMO4 is already ready. So let us tell you once again the benefits of this IMO or indigenous microorganisms. Basically what IMO does is biodegradation, bioleaching, biocomposting, nitrogen fixation, improving the soil fertility and as well as in the production of plant growth. The reason why we vlog about natural farming is because um, we want to prevent natural disasters like flash flood, landslide, and etc. Because the more the soil becomes degraded, it won't be able um, to absorb water anymore and time will come that our soil will no longer um, be able to produce crops. So while there are still beneficial microorganisms living in our area or in our environment let's continue to culture them and make them stronger let's stop killing them by using synthetic chemicals and allowing modern technology to produce artificial microorganisms which eventually would take over the natural we know that the modern farming technology is making our food production faster and easier but we will later pay the price 
which will make our farming hard to produce without paying more money. So as early as now, be with us and start natural farming.